Hey guys, what's up? Okay, we're about to make a monkey video with these freaking studs. Woo! I don't know right where the here. camera is. Right what's here, up? the camera Woo! is here. Monkeys! Monkeys, <laughs> woo! A few moments later. One, two, go! Stro, you you come over here. Nice. Talking right in the camera. Talking right in the camera. What thing? Trash can? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, wait, wait, listen to her sing, listen to her sing, just a little bit, please. My Lord, my Lord, and my God. Oh my god. So maybe he comes with the camera. It'll be better. Got it. Perfect. That was great. Cool. Yeah. Oh, I'll unfollow. I'm gonna die. This is so bad. One more. Guys, that was great. Oh, here! We going up! Wait, hold up. Go ahead and get a close up on her leg that is bleeding. This girl is intense. She goes all out. All out. That was she a tree. She didn't even notice that until we it was a tree. Yeah. 
She didn't even notice that until now. Okay, oh, oh, bye. Alright, peace guys. And there you have it guys. That's how you make a freaking epic monkey video. Boom! Yes, I just wrapped up two videos, workout videos. As you can see, I like to keep the workouts fun, keep the people entertained because if there's one thing I will say, I think that sometimes like the fitness community takes it a little too serious and I see people all the time just like basically <laughs> posting videos of like food and, and selfies and I just know that if I was on the outside looking in and I really didn't know anything about fitness but I wanted to get into it, I'd be like, whoa, that seems like a boring, miserable life. So you can have fun with fitness. See what you think is fun. I think flipping is fun. I love tumbling, stuff like that. That's my thing. Some people might find running fun. Some people might like weightlifting fun. So just find your fitness niche and have fun with it, guys. It doesn't have to be so serious. It doesn't have to be miserable. But yeah, I'm just cleaning up really dirty. Like, look at this, guys. And I'm bleeding. Those streets get screwed. So I'm gonna head over to a behind the scenes of a photo shoot. Um, Behouse came again. He's my awesome photographer. Always gets the best shots. But here, just just at the apartment complex, getting some good good photos that we can use. And I have somebody very special with me today. This one right hello, here. Hello. And and since the last time you saw him in my vlog, doing handstands, he's come a long ago. way. I used to call him Johannes. This is Johannes. Hey <laughs> it's Johannes. Yeah. We are gonna recreate this pic for Johannes right here with that one eye. Look at that eye. It's a beautiful Look eye. At this eye. That eye is my thumbnail. That's clickbait right there, that eye. And then he grabs the eye boob. And the boob. And the boob. The boob. <laughs> go monkey, go. All right, and he's packing up. Thank you so much for shooting us today. We did some crazy stuff. He's vlog. teaching me how to vlog. For, I'm is, learning from see, professional. See, this is a good, good angle. You were like here or here. Oh, I'm like, the hey guys, what's up? No, right here. They want to see you, right? Boom. <laughs> see, see what she did. <laughs> see, and the camera just loves you. The camera just gravitates. It just like it's a magnet. It's like I want more Johannes. No. Sorry guys, um, Ashley couldn't vlog because she forgot my, not my camera, her camera at my place. So, now I'm just delivering the camera and see if she's home because I don't even know if she's home. Let's see. Hi, what is the party? It's in the side. Do you want to come to the party? I wish. My name is Ashley. Yeah. Damn, Ashley! That's how I feel about mozzarella cheese. Hashtag real life. Hashtag be grateful. Squat. I got that angle though. Oh, booty! Did you just fart? Hey everyone. Definitely not. <laughs> oh my god. You definitely hit a whoopee cushion. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> yes, Stop. You did. No. I was gonna ask. Man, I love the drippers. This is how you become beautiful. Take note. It's one of those charcoal masks, guys. Um, we're peeling thing. Oh, I'm losing peels. Good way to end the day. Get all that n that nasty dirt and negativity off my face. <laughs> Chill out here in my bathroom as I pack. I'm gonna be in Texas. Team EHP going to the expo, doing some photo shoots, doing some video shoots. So, as you can see, I'm on luggage duty right now. So I'm packing, no fun, no fun, I'll be honest. I'm gonna miss LA. Only have one thing to say to that, and that's yeehaw. Yeehaw. I don't look no, so good. And I'm like, do you like, do you like my cat ears? I love them. <laughs> you look like Ariana Grande. Oh, drip. Oh, she dripped in a boob. Oh. We got boob drip. Woo. I got a boob drip too. <laughs> anyway, I do face masks every once in a while, but this one's a charcoal peel mask. Me and Jenny back there doing them before I uh, say goodbye for a week. I've been getting asked a lot, guys, if I um, am doing the Olympia and I just got my packet, you know, like last week. And, you know, um, let's see, where do I begin? Tough decision to make. You know, Olympia has, uh, winning three years in a row, 2013, 14, 15, has been the highlight of my career, especially in 2013 when I won, when I won the first time. But yeah, it, it's basically got me to where I am today. It's the reason why I'm living in LA and able to, you know, live my fitness dreams. And honestly, I don't know if I feel the same this year. Um, not that I think anything negatively of it, just more so the fact that I, my heart's not into it and 
I'm not as motivated as I used to be. I just feel like I've done what I needed to do and it's time to evolve and to move on. And right now at this point in my life, I just don't have that desire um, to prep for um, a show because you gotta realize guys that when you're at the top, when I was at the top for three years, having that pressure was so stressful even though I loved it and I wouldn't change it for anything. It's a lot of pressure. If I come, if I come in off, even slightly off, it's, it's a big deal. I am going to sit this year out, but that does not mean that I won't be back. Um, I just need to take this time to kind of like regroup and we'll see next year where it takes me. But as of right now, I kind of want to expand fitness and I don't want to just limit it to competing because competing can be very limiting. And you know, as, as you guys who have competed know, it does take a lot out of you, both mentally and physically. Do you want to add anything, Jen? Am I missing anything? Yeah, I just feel like you you have a lot of other things happening right mm -hmm. now. You know, when you when you do something so many times and you you overcome a challenge, it's not as exciting. Mhm. Mm yeah. yeah. This contract, I will not be signing it. So there you have it. I will not be competing in the 2017 Miss Bikini Olympia competition. Just got back from my trip to Texas for EHP. I didn't bring my camera. Shame on me. But I just got back. My luggage is still needs to be unpacked, but I'm proud of my roommates because they kept this place really nice. And then I came in and cluttered it up again because I got so many packages. I'm about to head out to dinner. This is my outfit for tonight. I feel like either a Spice Girl or like a brat doll. So thanks for everybody that visited me in Texas. That was so awesome. I got flowers, I got t-shirts, I got keychains, I got I got a whole bunch of goodies. I got cupcakes, but that was really nice of you guys to like um, send me that and to bring it to me and come visit. It meant the world to me. So again, thanks guys, you're awesome. Also, I forgot to mention this and I didn't want to like shout it out everywhere because I didn't want to sound like conceited or something, but I hit a million on Instagram. Yay! One million. I never thought that was going to happen. Social media is great because I get to connect with you guys from all over the world, um, which to me is very meaningful. So if I can touch and inspire people from halfway across the globe. Anyway, thanks for watching my vlog. More to come. I'll see you guys later.